Now I'm gonna give you the same little spiel that I give the other ones so you understand exactly what you, not exactly, but more or less what the, uh, the methodology of the exercise and the reason for it. You're all building dream teams, okay. We have 15 people in the hardcore class. On your dream teams, you got four to seven people, something like a 48 like that. The four to eight people that you have gonna have on the dream team will have infinitely more experience cumulative than are in that room, except for me, in that room. When you go through the analysis, and when I tell you what I want from the analysis, or generally what I want, and you come back and you put it on a uh, chart like that, and you present it to the group, you will be surprised, no matter how much you think you thought it through, that the kids will come up with stuff you didn't think of. I flat fucking guarantee it. And that's the same input that your dream team should be giving you. Because, you know, uh, although Alex has got some analytical experience, I mean, the dream team is gonna have more analytical experience because, and that's why you're recruiting them. So when you present your case, whatever it is, to the group, they will hone in, they will chime in, and they will say, what about this, what about this? Interestingly enough, the, the other group, the first the two deals are porn, pornography. Um, and so uh, right now they're probably pulling up the sites to see, to look at them. <laughs> when I was there, when I was there, they weren't doing it, you know, but the, um, they probably will afterwards. Okay, now, whether this one, they, they want to buy it for 105 million. Yes. Okay, okay. Um, is the industry, now don't answer me, just, is the industry in a place, in something that um, they should be really considering, okay? Uh, if it is, uh, is it in a country that uh, the laws may change, okay? Uh, is it, um, uh, you won't have this, uh, uh, what I told the porn guys, they're probably not paying taxes on the porn guys. So, I mean, uh, are they uh, in, a, in, a, in a tax haven? Would going, um, changing the headquarters to Ireland, make an inversion so you're not paying taxes uh, uh, be appropriate? Um, uh, the, uh, would uh, the uh, current uh, management makeup, does it look like it's, uh, it's correct uh, from whatever you've been able to gather so far? Um, how long has it been on the market? Uh, uh, some of the, uh, this, what business school is this one out of? Is this? Well, it was just uh, one file and on the top. Was it? Okay, this is, this, is, this is one of yours. This, it doesn't say who it belongs to? No, it no, was a teaser. Teaser, teaser. No, it was just from one file and without the name. Okay, that's right. Okay, okay. Okay. But now this is a case study. A part of case study. Yeah, but uh, it's also, you have the folders and have the names on the bottom. Okay. Um, the, um, uh, who currently is financing the deal if it's if it lists? Who's currently financing it? Is the purchase price right or wrong? Does the cash flow uh, uh, cover any potential de debt service? And if it doesn't, how much private equity would you recommend bringing into the deal? Um, would is this uh, is this a place? Um, I, forget, <laughs> I forget where Apollo's headquartered, but I mean, is it? Okay, okay. Is 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 this a place that uh, you? from your experience, and you probably know more about the spots, where you <laughs> be able to recruit people, you know, depending on the Midwest. I know, <clears throat> like Ohio, Tennessee, et cetera, it's uh, lower cost of living. Uh, New York City, Los Angeles, higher cost of living. London, higher cost of living, et cetera, et cetera. Um, the, um, is, this, is this something that um, the, uh, you would make a preliminary decision when you make the presentation to the group that we should take it to the next level, sign an LOI. Would, I, I, you wouldn't have got this information without an LOI, I'm pretty sure. But at what level are you willing to commit time? Is this a good uh, source of time for you to spend? Because if you're part of an acquisition team, you're going to not just have one deal to look at, you're going to have several deals to look at. Um, wh where, where, at what point would you fish your cut bait? Should we get up the pot? In other words, at what level of interest do you really have? Do you need a breakup fee? Okay, is it um, a yes or no? Uh, on this size deal, I'd say yes. On some of these other size deals, I'd say no. 
Um, not not because they're not necessarily warrant breakup, they, but the smaller deals, the smaller the management teams, the smaller the financing, the higher the probability that nobody's going to want to do a breakup fee. Because it's the smaller deals that fall through more than the bigger deals. When a big company goes after a company, they've already done enough homework to whereby uh, they're pretty serious that they want to um, make a, um, an entree into the market. Um, Okay, what, what industry are they involved in? Uh, Midwest based insurance tool and in marketing organization. Yeah, okay. Supporting yeah. network financial advisors, maybe print information out from some Yeah. Um, okay. I'm trying to think that um, that's a deal from uh, the last hardcore one of the kids was trying to buy that. Yeah, so that's one of the business school deals. Okay, what, what, what questions, if any, do you have? I'm going to be warming back and forth. Uh, I have one question. Uh, you, you told us that uh, we can, I uh, mean, we have different um, variations. The first one, the first level was like you finance just only the desk. If it's not enough money, so go to the next, the next. So you um, analyze all of them. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Um, this one, uh, each of the correct, and I, I, I'm not positive, but I'm almost positive that this is going to require more than debt. As I remember the numbers, as I remember the numbers, so free unencumbered cash flow yeah. must cover debt. Uh, and if it doesn't, sure. can does it is it is there a 10 or 15 or 20 percent shortfall? I mean, uh, uh does it um, which is normal for a uh, MES or uh, a bridge financing. Uh, and if, if, if it's more than that, then you're gonna have to go to private equity uh, because a 105 million deal is not likely that your friends, schools, and family are gonna be able to put up the money. Um, the, um, and so uh, how, how would you, is your best case, how would you like to have it structured? Uh, um, what's your best, what, not best case, but uh, how much how much time, and you can relate it back to your own dream teams, like in our case now, you know, uh, is this something, uh, notwithstanding it's in a different industry, I mean, is this something that uh, would sound uh, uh, palatable uh, to um, the guys that we already got on board? Uh, and um, I don't know if it says anything in this deal about whether management wants to stay on or doesn't want to stay on. Uh, also, I don't remember on this deal how much debt is already associated with the deal, and uh, is that debt transferable? What, what, you, what you really want is find deals when they're bigger that you can transfer the debt because and or, not or, and add debt onto it because they've already been servicing the debt, and so they're going to be happy to have Assuming they like the new buyers, you, that they have a transfer it and add a piece onto it. That, that's the perfect world. Now, in some cases, they'll say, we didn't like those assholes, fuck them, uh, we went out. That's the worst case scenario. That's the worst case scenario. And in, in some cases, guys, it's, you just have to pass because depending on the multiples, if this is a high multiple deal and it's already got debt on it, and somebody was willing to finance the son of a bitch, so he's the most likely candidate to go back to, or that, that group of banks to go back to, because you don't have to reinvent the wheel. You don't have to, uh, uh, you don't have to sell them on the new team and perhaps an extension of the debt. Um, and, or they may say, okay, we've got 60 million debt on the deal. Um, we'll continue the 60, we'll bring it to 90, but we want to redo the 60 because that interest rates may have changed. Uh, and so we want to refinance. We're, we'll be the primary lender. And we'll even be the head of a new syndicate. But we want our 60 million original debt refinanced uh, because gonna, and then that also gives them an opportunity to charge more fees. Okay, because at the end of the day, you know, majority of the, of the income for the big investment banks and the, and the regular banks is fee driven, not interest driven. And the reason why it's not interest driven anymore is because interest rates are so fucking low. And, and when I say, I mean, even though it, it's not 100% accurate, I mean, they're, they're giving away money now. Money's so cheap. 
And um, the, uh, so when we come back at a quarter uh, to one, is that what I said? Yeah, quarter to one. Um, if you're done, fine. If you're not done, you may have some questions. And you'll ask a new question, and I'll answer them in front of the group. A couple of the guys are going to be done because they got the, the, the first couple of cases are little cases. I think the porn guys will be done. Uh, the porn guys may have to go take a shower, but the, uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, the, um, and it's funny, we got the two Frenchmen, the Dutchman, and the weed man doing porn right now. Uh, quite a combination. <laughs> um, the, uh, we don't have any uh, Bible thumpers. Although, um, in the last, last hardcore, we had a couple of Bible thumpers, and it was Christmas, and, and so everybody got all, you know, melancholy, but anyway. Okay. So, so, so we're supposed to do one meal each. Okay, well, you, because I don't mean, you're not going to get done, uh, you won't get done with this. So, I mean, I mean, this is going to carry on until this afternoon. Yeah. A couple of the guys have little TV, if you've got some little deals farther on down your, your, your uh, thumb drive. But uh, we'll give you the time that's required because I want to get up and make a presentation. Um, you won't be getting up at quarter to one to give the presentation. You may have some questions that I'll answer and or the group will answer. And then in the afternoon, you can get your final deal. Okay? I get the two questions. Okay. Um, and then regarding your financing, do we have the flexibility and what time frame uh, we... Yeah, well, it's up to you. It's up yeah. to you. Okay. Okay. And the presentation on the board. So yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. And um, we're not going to make you do it in Russian. No. <laughs> I almost died when Kira read that in Russian. 